Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to Dying Light 2. Oh, hello. In the last video, we uh, got our inhibitor thing going, we got our biomarker, and kind of opened up the game a little bit. There's a blue thing down there that I want to go explore. That's like a... Remember how we used to save random people back in the first game? Same idea again. Let's go see what we can see. Down there somewhere. And then we're going to head over to the bazaar, which I believe is over there, and have a jolly good time. Am I meant to be chasing you or? Oh, okay. <laughs> Apparently he's a bandit. <laughs> You're right. Nope, oh, down he goes. Okie dokie. <laughs> right, did we level up? Am I crazy? God damn it. <laughs> right, I am crazy. <clears throat> Let's go spend some time at the bazaar and uh, begin exploring the city and kind of doing what we want for the first time, which is cool. Really, I've been smacked around this stamina meter. Ooh. Game, stop lagging. I'll not wake you up. It's quite hard to play this game when the lag is this insane. Going on. So why did you not die? Come here. All right, game. Calm down. Are we done? Are we chill? I don't think we're chill. Um, I'm gonna stick thingy on. Let me go in advanced settings. Where is everything's on max? And it should be fine. But it doesn't seem to be. ELSS is basically upscaling that's very smart. <laughs> Dark Hollow's Forsaken Stores. Dark Hollow's and Forsaken Stores are two open world locations that contain valuable loot. During the day, the full of infected, it's smart to explore them at night. Forsaken Stores provide you rare craft parts and Dark Hollow's for valuables. Okay. Where am I? I mean, if it's regular infected, I don't mind killing them, really. Get some combat points, if nothing else. I mean, the game's open now, right? But he is to explore and <laughs> do everything in the entire game, so. It's a hell of a position you got there, buddy. Go to sleep, little zombie. Go to sleep. Who's a good zombie? Can. 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 Precious antique cans. Look what you've done to them. Nice little Simpsons reference for you there. Yeah, the game feels so. I mean, it's, 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 it's a tech thingy game. It's gonna... Every now and again... Wait, what's going on? Why's my thing gone? It's gonna freak out every now and again and have little bugs and stuff because it's... <laughs> it's them, you know? Oh, is it down there? See you later. So close to leveling up. Ah, zombie! I have to loot first. Stop being rude. How bad do we reckon it is down there <laughs> if I choose to go now? 
Do we reckon it's a terrible idea? I mean, I feel like I'm going to do it anyway, so... Mm. Is that what it is? Is it marked on the map? No. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a little drop down. I mean, I'm still... This can't be it, right? Because I can easily access the outside. So I don't really know what this is. I do like about this game, you get right down into the zombie killing, you know? <laughs> There's very little dilly-dallying around. It's episode 3 and I'm <laughs> slaughtering zombies en masse. Like freaking some fish or something. Whoa, whoa! Back off, back off. Alright, alright, alright. He's a hoodie! He's an asbo! <laughs> you take that hood off, son. I'm gonna have scraps for days. Love me some scrap. I mean, the game just told me about these dark things, right? So I've got to assume there's one here, or that this is one, or something, right? Otherwise that would be nonsense. Alright, surely? <laughs> Maybe there's just one nearby and I happen to walk close enough to activate that. What's going on? Blood. Blood. Gallons of the stuff. Give them all that they can drink and it'll never be enough so give them blood. 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 Why is it around here that my immunity thing starts to kick off? Like, right around here. Can't really figure it out. What am I missing? <laughs> I feel like I must be missing something. I couldn't for the life of you tell you what. Game, why do you hate this part? <laughs> what is it about this bit that you hate? Is it up there? I can't get up there. Is there a staircase? Okay. Maybe it's up here? Oh, well, I mean, we'll just have a little look around and we'll kill some zombies. Never hurt anyone, right? Except the zombie. And me every time I get bitten. Which is moderately often. <laughs> I mean, exploring... Abandoned... Inverted commas. <laughs> zombie filled houses is a zombie tradition, you know. Right, this house is this house is a dirty rotten liar, I swear. Wants to suggest that it's something funky, but it's nothing funky at all. It's the least funky thing I've ever seen. I'm trying to remember the button. Oh. Remembered it. See if anything pops up. He screams. Mildly concerning. Oh, oh, oh. Center for stage four. To, ah, see, that might be 
Scavenge inhibitors. Okay, that's tempting. So you want to go during the night time for those. So, survivor. Saute the mushrooms. Hey. Blanch the asparagus. Fry the onion until translucent. Of that's... course, we don't have any of these. So we'll just eat what we got. I was literally about to say, that's just a potato, mate. <laughs> What's this book? I want to explore. I want to see all the things. Oh, hello. Okay. Hey, I heard Carl talking about Who are you guys? Who are all these people? Got a gig as a finisher tomorrow. Someone's got to take care of the fighters roaming the streets around the bazaar. I'm going to jump. Let's see what happens. Uh-oh. Oh, that was close. Nope, nope. Okay. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I was thinking. Oh, wow. I feel like I should have taken lots of damage there. Oh, yep, there it is. Now this is a suspicious looking building. Why do I feel like this might have been the building they were talking about? <laughs> Zombies are higher level. My thingies. It's almost broken, but it's not broken, right? It's, dead, it's fine. So my immunity is dropping right now. So if I hop back outside, yeah. So I can clear an area, hop back outside. To as many takedowns as humanly possible. What? Oh no! It's not a one-hand kill anymore. Because he's a high level zombie. Try again. It's the same over time, yep. Okay. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. Can't kill high-level zombies. Sweet! Active landing, I think that's really necessary. Safe landing, really good. Landing jump, jump instantly. That one less useful. Yeah, I don't, don't like that one at all. Fast climb, let's jump. Huh. I'm going to take that one. Oh, I need park. Oh, yeah, I'm looking at park because I'm a dummy. Air kick. Perfect dodge. Dodge at the right time. Grapple. Grapple throw. Volt power kick. Heal stomp. Head stop enemies that lay on the ground. That is pretty useful, typically. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, this does not sound particularly useful. Volt power kick. I force your volt kick. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, damn, son. That's my... There we go. You know it's boring me. Ah, staircase. There's got to be something here, right? God, these high-level zombies are hard work. Oh. Survivor? I've got a friend. I never have friends. Good teamwork, buddy. I've got to say, I want stamina more than I want anything else. <laughs> I think we're safe after all. There's nothing. Ah, uh, isn't this where the book was though? That's what I wanted. Oh no, the book's there. 
What is it? I don't understand. What am I looking at? Okay. Well, now we know what books are. You know, we've got to learn these things. Right, we're going to go check out the blue, and then we are going to go to the bazaar. No more dilly-dallying around. It's one of those games. It's very easy to dilly-dally. And I'm an, I am a natural-born dilly-dallier. <laughs> you know? Come on. No, I've got to remember that. I can't do that. It's, a, it's an ability to, to grab ledges like that, I believe. I don't have it. <laughs> that needs to be a priority. What have we got here? Oh crap. Just gonna do a little bit of crafting. Oh! Oh! see you. <laughs> oh, hello. It's a party. There's a zombie. Zombie. Hey, don't take my experience. <laughs> Maybe I am a blocker. Don't let him run. Parkour! Okay, they're worth doing. I think there was a problem in the last game where those side things often felt a little bit useless. Because, um... But you don't really get anything, you know? You can, you got, like, a little bit of cash. So I think maybe they've decided if we just give people a bundle of experience for both skills, then they will be much more likely to go through them, you know? more lockpicks. What have we got in here then? Firm shoes. Nice. Canned food. Do some... Oh, hello. Ugh. Ugh. What's going on there? That didn't take long. Bloody hell. Oh, everything's filthy. Who runs sanitation in this town? What? Where? There? Huh? The game is telling me there's a GRE inhibitor nearby. I feel like I have an obligation to find out where. Hi. It's quite a lot of you guys. That block is difficult. I'll give him that much. Try this, asshole! You're not allowed to dodge. There's so many of them. What is this nonsense? Zombie! Bloody Nora. You're the one getting cut in the face. I don't know what you want from me. Can one of you die, please. But the other's five of the buggers. One down. Two down. Oh, that was nice. 
Such good timing. Alright. What would your mother think if she heard you saying such things, honestly? <laughs> hey, don't do that. I'm looting your friends. Stop throwing things at me. Alright, you. Oh. Right. <laughs> okay, I see a tree. Is the tree important? What does that mean? What do all these things mean? I don't know. Area? What's that, what is the area for, though? Such confusion. There's a question mark underneath me. It's there. I don't know what any of this means. We're going to figure it out. Oh. Okay. Is that on my map, <laughs> at least? Yes. Okay, cool. That's a safe house, apparently. So we're not gonna we're not gonna do the store now. Whoa! What is going on in here? I think this is the one that can turn into a safe. Room. Oh god. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, 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 uh. Run, run, run! <laughs> oh boy, this isn't even the scary place, I don't think. But it is scary. Go away, go away. Go oh yeah, yeah. Ah, okay, maybe this is actually just a plan to lure them outside. Oh, baby. Got me a big boy now. Oh, yes. Oh, zombie. Oh, oh we quite done. <laughs> God, these things are everywhere. What's in that? I mean, at least I'm going the right way now, right? Are you open this? Okay, I know there's a store and there's an undiscovered building. We can come back there later on. Over there. Let's go have a little peek in here. This could be a GRE thing, you know? Oh, yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Got immunity booster. Very cool. Ranger gloves. Very cool. And an inhibitor. I need two more of those to do anything with. We've got an immunity booster. We've got a military med kit. An antique hammer. Another fancy ass chest. Living the dream here. Ah, oh, and a first time lockpick. Oh, baby, it's my day. What have we got here? Nurse mitts. Immunity booster, which I'm assuming boosts my immunity. <laughs> Because I'm a genius like that. I figured that out all by myself. Actually, it's been equipped. Ah, oh, they do the same thing. Okay, well. Let me make a moment. You know what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna craft them. What's that? Okay, let me have a quick little look at our gear, because we got some new stuff, didn't we? And that has an auto or that has. Okay, we get a bit more parkour XP. Again, more ranged. And this, oh my god, we got loads. Okay. Um, well, these have armor and these don't. Goes for a medic, a class specializing in parkour combat and healing. So, less stamina cost, survivor sense range, damage resistance 2.3, damage parkour attacks, health regen 3.1. So, right, oh, hello. Nice. It's all ranged. Why is it all ranged? 
Oh, that's actually... Oh, goes for a tank. That actually might be better, weirdly enough. 200 weapon damage plus 5%. That's a decent chunk. And survivor sense duration. I like that. Although this has that. And survivor sense range. Yeah, I'll keep this for now. What looks coolest? <laughs> Priorities in order. Alright. Blue. And then I'm going over there. Nothing after this blue one, okay? That's the deal. Wait, I need that. Why are you bees? Okay. Ow. Oh, oh zombie. I've got you now, what was that alarm? I don't know, man. I feel like you fear big guy with the two handed axe. What? Wait, there's, there's so many of them! There's like 20 of the dudes! Leave me alone while I heal, okay? That's the deal. We all make this deal. <laughs> Zombie! Madness going on here. So many zombies, so many bandits. Finally. We're getting there. We're getting there. God, I'm gonna need some new weapons soon enough. Get off me, you dick. I'm healing. I had to kill like 20 of you bastards, alright? I'm allowed to heal. Maybe I should be doing the kick. Is it that much better though? Well, it probably is when you do it right. Oh the hell! <laughs> oh yeah, did it finally. Got him! At some point, when I've killed so many of these guys, at what point do you think, you know what, maybe I shouldn't be messing with this guy? Like, do you not think you should be running? Dick? Oh, hey. Alright, well, you're on the other side. You're not relevant to my interests. So many enemies, man. So many enemies. That is nuts what I just went through. <laughs> Get some loot, though. Well, not that much, though. You fucking kidding me? There's, there's at least two of them in there. 
How you doing, buddy? Let's get you out of here. Oh, I have to kill them. Bye! <laughs> Wait, didn't I just get a drop kick? Did I pick up the drop kick? Uh, I can't remember. No, I didn't. I got dodged. I should have got the drop kick. Did that do damage? Who knows? Get back down here! <laughs> I knew there was two of them. Alright, come on. Come on. I might have been for so much of my medicine. I don't have any more. <laughs> Now I have a hammer! <laughs> oh, see you later! <laughs> Don't tell if he's dead. <laughs> oh my god, right, that was hard work. Have I still not leveled up anything? Seriously? Life is pain. Why can't I... I keep getting this weird thing where I, I can't seem to use my survive for sense. Hello. Oh, I need to get my reward. Well, what's this? Man, I just want to explore everything. <laughs> I need to resist for at least a little bit, you know? Let's play the actual game a little bit. Alright, give me my reward, and then I'm going to the bazaar. It's been about half an hour already. Thanks. Alright, I'm out. Bizarre. Nothing else matters, okay? I'm tired of fighting bloody... Those nerds. I don't know, man. This... This place feels important somehow. Hmm. Okay. I wanted active landing, yeah? Yeah. You ready? Oh. Well, I didn't need to use it there. Alright. Uh, can we just run through the building? It's probably quicker. It's probably quicker. It's probably quick. Yeah, there we go. Like, <laughs> there'll be a way out. I'm pretty sure there'll be a way out. Again, my my thing keeps not working. Very annoying. I loot the barrel. This. Now I'm getting out. I just want the rags. All I want is the rags. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. I just want the rags, okay? Yeah, I just want to go through the house. I always like that kind of thing, where you run through an open door, an open window, and you end up... Ooh, what's this? That looks important. Let's leave it. It's rags. It's always rags. It's never, ever not rags. Just assume it's going forward. I really feel I should be on the rooftop right now. Dark Hollow. Okay, so again, we want to come... Wait. Is that the spooky one, though? Or is that the one I can do it? Uh, 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 daytime. Darkness brings out the infected during the day. They congregate at night. They must feast. Yeah, so that's a hollow. That's a forsaken store. And then that's something else. All right, cool. Wait, 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 wait. Look how much um, combat and... Okay, okay. Well, look, look, look. I said we're going to the thing, and we're going to the thing. Oh, hello. What I do need to realise is that not every house is important. <laughs> I think that's the first step in my journey. Ah! Go away. Man, those spears are awesome. Huge fan of those. Yeah, it worked! <laughs> I'm quite proud of that. 
Oh, wrong button. Yeah, pretty chuffed. <laughs> I saw the two of them. I've got a big ass spear. Game. Stop it. What is... What is this? Uh, you're just banging around on that. Right, I want to see what this is. There's a question mark right here. It's right next to me, folks. It's right next to me. How could I possibly have... God damn it. How could I possibly ignore it, you know? That would be the irresponsible thing to do. And I am nothing... If not an immensely responsible man. Oh my god, work! Thank you! Where is it? Oh! Oh no! You know what? I think I'll pass. <laughs> I think I'm gonna run away. Never mind. Never mind. Ugh. Let's get to the bloody bazaar, shall we? Wait, what's going on? What's this? Take heed and bear witness. Side quest? This is the news of the last city standing. I think I can kill him, you know. Today, a chicken and a young you went missing from Deirdre Hughes' rooftop farm in South Horseshoe. Several eyewitnesses reported seeing a suspicious woman wearing a red gown and a blue Side quest? I keep telling everyone we should be getting ready for winter. Trade! Okay, cool. Craft master's allow you to buy and upgrade blueprints. Upgrading blueprints makes items you craft more powerful. Upgrade a blueprint. Ah, okay, this is what we use the um the heads for. All right, I like that. Items used for blueprint upgrades can be looted from special affected. Easy to find at night, marked on a map. Cool. Okay, well, I mean, we killed a few. Maybe we can upgrade our medicine or something. Okay, and we can buy blueprints as well. Endurance booster, UV bar, fire arrows, flame venom weapon mod tips, and shafts. Not good shaft. I can upgrade base damage on weapons. Upgrade. Uh, so I need infected trophy uncommon for that. And that is going to make it apply a little quicker. That seems really good. Let's grab that now. And then it's going to heal more, but we need more. I need some money for that as well. Infected trophy makes more durable. Yeah, you know what, why not? I can buy craft parts as well. All right, sweet. Come back later. What's going on here? Hello, I'm Henkel. This student here was curious about my lesson today, about when the guns were confiscated in Villador, and what happened afterwards. He wants to light a candle on the site of the March Massacre. The March Massacre? Yes. 64 people died that day, gunned down like sitting ducks. If you want to know more, you should go and see for yourself. Why can't he? No one can leave the building while school is in session. Children shouldn't walk around the bazaar on their own. Hmm. I thought you'd be more worried about them falling into a dark zone. Oh, kids nowadays are too smart to fall into a silly hole. Anyway, could you light a candle for him, young man? You might learn something yourself. Sure, though I was pretty lousy at history. History is boring when someone tells you about it. It starts being fascinating when you can touch it. Touch it? Yes, take this candle and go to the monument of the World Art Congress. Or what's left of it. It's close by. Contact me when you get there. You'll see what my lesson was about today. Okie dokie. Did not realize this was a school <laughs> until like right now, if I'm honest. Hello? Okay. We don't have much time left. I want to get to the bazaar. We're not doing any side quests. We're going to the bazaar. We're going to the bazaar. I mean, I'm always going to play the game like this, so I don't know why I'm trying to, like, 
apologize. I don't have to apologize. And no one expects me to apologize. I didn't need to explore those houses, though. I got very confused by that. Let me just have a look at my map again. So that's a bazaar. That's unavailable. There's an encounter right behind me. It's right there. If it's like 20 dudes, I'm not doing it. All right? I'm just saying that right now, okay? Wait, I think it's... Wait, where is it? Bandit chase. These I'm okay with. Not great at this, are you, buddy? See you later. Zombie. Zombie. See, that seems... That's worth the time, right? I got a decent amount of loot. I got 200 XP for both of my things. That's worth doing. If you have to kill 12 bandits, eh, I feel less good about it. Find shelter. All right, I'm allowed in here now, finally. I've got my bloody thing. Okay, so, the bazaar. Finally it took us so long to get here. Oh, there's, yeah, there's merchants and craftmasters and I'm assuming a bunch of quests. All right, I think I actually have to go inside from the front door. I just want to have a look, look around. I was hoping for some honey. It's on my purchase list, if I get the opportunity. I like that upgrade system. Forcing you to go out at night and do things. That's cool. Alright, this is pretty cool. I do think things like this would pop up in a zombie apocalypse eventually. Remember there's something like this in The Walking Dead as well, in the uh, in the game. Then it got burned, <laughs> as they always will. It's in a church as well, that's cool. No, we do that all the time in modern days, we turn every church into a bar. Why not turn it into a bazaar? You can do it, Carlos, I believe in you. What's up, Carlos? What's your problem? Hey, aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang? Yeah. Man, you were in luck there. I could use some of that luck. I'm Alberto's apprentice. Not for long, probably. It's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. What's okay, well, I know what a Craftmaster is. What's this test about? I have to design something useful for the citizens. I already invented underwater reading glasses for Alberto, then a retractable dog leash, but he kept jamming. And besides, we have no dogs here. All my ideas are worthless. Now is my last chance to prove that I am not worthless. So I spent the last several weeks walking around the bazaar and thinking, thinking hard. And then I hit it. Our goats. They are kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence, energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I called this invention the electric fence. Are we to assume that society has forgotten that electric fences exist? Because that seems unlikely to me. Yeah, that's a little rough. Stressed goats can give bitter milk. Seriously? Goats get stressed? Wouldn't you, if someone electrocuted you and then went for your crotch? Oh, no. It's only a very small voltage. Won't do more than tickle them. I like it when people tickle me and go for the crotch. <laughs> so, what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see. I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. As far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. 
Alberto says they'll be there for sure. But it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. You have to go there at night. And the other option? Whatever's left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. Bandits roam in the area, so it's possible there's nothing left there. In which case, you'll have to look for other patrol remains, or take a night trip to the store. <laughs> Looks like you're in luck after all. I have the parts you need on me. Are you serious? That's just fantastic! Heaven must have sent you! Hey, here. Not sure what I gave him, but that's okay. I don't know how to thank you. One more thing. Could you help me set up my show? My installation's right outside the main entrance. Turn it on, please. I'll go get Alberto. Wait till he sees it. Yes, master. Meet me by the goat pen, then. Near the wall. Anything else, master? Well, I gotta go. Sometimes I wake up at night and forget to fall even half. Do my thing first. No, big boy. Hey, hangman. How's the neck? It's all right. Who is Barney? Everyone knows Barney here. I don't. Tell me. Well, I wouldn't bother yourself about Barney. He doesn't like nosy people. Liable to piss him off if he finds out. Hey, you don't want that kind of trouble. Well, now I definitely want to know more. Okay. He's Sophie's younger brother. Some say he's crazy, but he's a pillar of the bazaar. The PKs are afraid of him, and they should be. Barney is no one to fuck with. Who is Barney? Why did I ask about Barney in the first place? <laughs> Had I heard the name Barney before now? Alright, I'll, I'll talk to you in a minute. Hey, you're a pilgrim, aren't you? That's right. Do you hang people for that, too? Uh, I just wanted to say that I was rooting for you. Yeah, uh-huh. Thanks for standing up for me. What? But I, I didn't... Ah, I get it. Sarcasm. Look, it's not that easy to go against the crowd. Sure. I know people are scared of pilgrims sometimes, but... <sighs> Shit. You survived outside the walls. <laughs> that to be some. You're talking Ahab. <clears throat> Shop man. Merchants like to buy craft parts, new weapons and other items, blah blah blah, they have the most powerful weapons, you can find merchants in all the main hubs. Cool. Sell. All viables, yeah, okay, we've suddenly got a lot more money. Uh, okay, so we don't need this. I don't think I need the medic. Nah. I'm gonna keep, uh, there's no point in keeping anything. <laughs> Sell those, because I'm going to wear those. Um, if I'm not using it, it's getting sold. Them's the bricks. Keeping all the resources, obviously. I do have a ton of crap weapons. We should sell some. Cool. Okay, got a bit of cash. What do you sell? You sell a gorgeous machete. It's another Billy Hook. Uh, low stamina damage bonus. Damage first infected 25% as well. Oh, even better. And it's got a shaft socket. <laughs> How much does that cost? 607. How much have I got? I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm not buying anything like that at the moment. That's, that's crazy talk. I'm buying medicine. Oh, it's quite expensive though. Dust filter. Which does stamina regen, which is cool. Stamina cost, minus, which is cool. Damage one heaven. Okay, that's really cool. Uh, I might grab that. Medic cap, neck gator. I don't know what I want to be right now. Brawler sounds good. Oh, ranger stuff. Why is it all ranger stuff? I don't think I want to buy anything. Right? Uh, maybe some medicine. Actually, do you sell honey? I'd rather buy honey. Okay, I'm gonna buy a couple of medkits. Makes me sad, but I'm really low. Okay. Howdy. You're the craft master. So I assume that you've got the same stuff as the other guy, and I can't do much about this. Although we do have more money now, so we can buy some 
Keep buy oh, do I want to buy a weapon mod? I do, right? I should, I should have... Yeah, screw it. Nothing but flame! I've got that as well. Okay, can we upgrade any of them? Probably not, but worth a shot. No, I need infected trophies. Okay. So then, if I've got... Because I've got a decent weapon, right? In this, uh, this, this one right here. Modify. Tip. Scraps, resin, alcohol. How much durability? It's got quite a lot. Oh, it's going to reset the durability as well. Interesting. It's a shaft. Yes. Maybe what's worth doing is waiting until this is nearly dead. And then... Mm -hmm. it, it repairs it. So maybe... Yeah. Hmm. I'm just going to stick the flame tip on. No, I'm not. I'm going to wait. This is the weapon we're using. And if we don't find anything better in the meantime, then we'll upgrade this one. That's the idea. And we're going to buy the headgear as well, I think. Just because I don't have any right now. Did I sell my chest piece? Do, 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 do. It's quite cheap as well, so. I've heard store. There we go. Looking much better. Actually, looking like a character from Mortal Kombat, but that's not even. Oh, wait, I don't have a chest either. We'll get there eventually, folks. <laughs> chest piece. Torso. No, they're braces. No, he doesn't have any. Hello! Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Listen, pilgrim. We can make a killing, you and me. You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? Julian, Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Devin says. What? But... I don't sell water. Liar. Luke told me he got it from you. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? Oh, well, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast. Water's infected. I'll save you, buddy. Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. I thought you didn't sell water. <laughs> so, uh, maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of Billador, on Hounfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it, and half my flour is yours. Can you do that for me? I guess I could check it out. And there's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and... Can you go warn him? He's also on Hamfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. I can go awfully sus there, buddy. People will always complain. We're alive, and that's what counts. What are those? They're bottles. See something yellow. Found the yellow thing. Okay, so the last thing we're gonna do is get this quest done with the goats. My aunt Have you ever planted common foods are good for digestion? <laughs> Chamomile? Hell, I can't even get none of these brown. Maybe try venison. That'll help you out. Aw, lost doggo! Oh no, I wanna save the doggo! That's Looking a lot of missing places. Dead people. It says here they're missing. Same difference. They never find them anyway. Now yeah, then why the board? 
It's been 15 years. Many people disappeared back then. My neighbor lost his two kids. But life goes on. Except nobody has the courage to take those photographs down. But it's hopeless. Since there are no night runners, the search always ends the same. I'm a night runner. Decided. <laughs> Have you heard of kids who were in the GRE tests? Huh. And who wasn't in the tests? The young, the old, the blind, the deaf. Everyone came to find a vaccine. Some for cash. Others to cheat destiny and not get infected. But that was the devil's bargain of Villador. Walled in with the plague, but given the chance to be the ones who gave the cure to the world. Well, the virus won. The study was eventually discontinued. And the children? Officially, no one tested on children. Human rights and other crap. And unofficially? And unofficially. Apparently, some of the kids were taken out of the city. The rest? Well, they just scattered around the city, abandoned. If the infected didn't get them, then hunger or darkness did. Those night runners, tell me about them. What's there to say? Nearly all of them are dead. When they were around, they were the only ones not afraid to go out at night. They rescued those who didn't manage to get to a shelter. But of the entire group, only a few survived, including Frank, their former commander. Once upon a time, he was great. Now, he drinks himself into a stupor at his place in the central loop. Hard to say how much longer he'll be around. When did all this happen? A long time ago. Looking at you, you were still a kid yourself. Once upon a time, I came across two of them. Two girls. They were five or six years old. And it looked like they hadn't eaten for a month. What were their names? I don't remember. I threw them some old bread and took off because they were shaking as if they were about to turn. Red eyes. Swollen veins. I don't know what they were giving them there. Those psychos from the GRE. Where are all these kids at now? After all those years, most of them are probably dead. If someone got luckier and is still wandering around, they would probably be in the central loop. More peacekeepers there. Easier to survive. Someone must know more. Why? The past is the past, and there's no point in dredging it back up. Everyone has their own problems. Here and now, Pilgrim. Everyone fights for themselves. He's an optimistic source, isn't he? I wish someone would deal with the assholes that hijacked our water. Where is the goat? Uh. Oh, I'm going to get a blueprint. Nice. None of you are relevant, right? No. Okay, so we're going to do this and then we'll uh, call it a day. I knew this old couple. Also, I want to see a goat. <laughs> More importantly than anything. Goats? You okay? They'll be fine. They're toughies. Goats. They're well known for it. Uh. Uh. Carlos! Kill the goat! Everything alright? No. It's grilled. The goat is grilled. I'm such an idiot. What happened? I must have overcalculated the voltage. See, he's useless. I'm sorry. 
I don't know how I could get it so wrong. I told you it would be a waste of time. Why? I don't think so. This is very, very... It has big, huge... You're saying it has potential. Potential, yes. It could be an effective weapon. A weapon? It's a ready formula. If you just use it on a weapon, it could raise your odds against turned creatures. The brave goat gave its life to science. There's dinner for everyone. And you? I take you as a... Uh, and pronounce you a... Uh, a... Uh, a... a... Uh, Craftmaster? Really? Oh my gosh, thank you. Thank you. We'll talk later. Come, Vincenzo. I can't thank you enough. Here, take this. If it's not strong enough, come round to my Craftmaster workshop. Sure, thanks. Just, uh, watch yourself out there, okay? No worries, friend. Ugh. <laughs> right, goat. It's all the weapon mods. You need to have a blueprint for it and any required craft parts on the right weapon. Check the number of mod slots on the weapon icon. The best weapons have three slots available. Griff Shop tip. Cool. So it looks like you don't craft weapons anymore, necessarily. It's interesting because some systems in this game seem less complex than the, the first game, which is usually, you know, not how it goes. But I think it's for the best. Alright, cool. Um, so I'm hoping that just saved. <clears throat> Meet the people. How am I really not done that yet? Have I really not done this yet? There's no one else. Is there? I mean, there must be. Inside quest area. I must have missed someone. Um, let's go upstairs, I guess. Kind of forgot you could go upstairs. That would explain the situation. Though they usually have an icon, so I don't see... I, I, this is what I was looking for anyway. A bed. Um. Hmm. I'm not sure. We'll wait till morning. That'll save the game. We'll end it there. So, it took us a while to get there. But when we did, we got our quests done nice and quickly. We killed a goat. Lots of positive things. Going to see how we do this only way out. Um, but we'll pick that up in the next video. It's a lovely balmy 8am. I hear... Hello! Love you. Uh, so, we've got that quest. And then we've got history lesson. And we've got cheers. So, we'll do, we'll do them in um, order as well. Meet the people of the bazaar. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, we were... Oh, activities as well. Oh, yeah, okay. So, we've got a couple of windmills and we've got a quarantine. I really want to do that just because it's... So it is level four, though. And I think I'm level one. Or two, maybe. I don't know how that works. No, I'm level one. Well, what's this? Player rank. Yeah, we've got a while to go. <laughs> so, we're going to ignore that one for now. Thank you very much for joining me. I'll see you, lovely folks, very soon. Cheers, much of as always. Bye-bye.